Barry was one of the hardest hit areas during July's historic flooding. The city is still in the process of recovering. And while trying to rebuild, City Council has had an ongoing leadership issue. The mayor wants to get rid of the city's planning commissioner. For a third time in as many months, Barry City Council voted on removing the commissioner, who's less than four months on the job. NBC5's Tyler Boronsky was at tonight's City Council meeting and has more on this situation that's kind of an ongoing situation going on in Barry tonight. Tyler? Barry manager Jake Hemrick has pushed for the removal of planning commissioner Raylene Mounier after he says she acted unprofessional on her podcast by claiming she berated a potential downtown business investor on his political views and threatened she would not keep them or their new business safe in the community. Mounier was appointed last June for a three-year term. City councilors went back and forth on how severe the situation really was. It would have taken a unanimous vote of the seven council members to dismiss her. This time, the vote to remove Mounier didn't even receive 50% of council's backing. Three voting yes, two voted no, and two councilors abstained. Sometimes their arguments just seem, they seem petty. Uh, yeah. You know, they do. And, and we have to sometimes recognize that we're not going to agree on everything. It's not life and death. It's a terrible example for the youth of our community to see officials going online, engaging in online spats, again, threatening the safety of somebody. That's a serious thing. Mounier declined to speak to us on camera. She did post about it recently on her personal Facebook account, saying personal thoughts and feelings do not belong at the council table. The council is supposed to be working for the community as a whole and not have personal vendettas or grudges against a city committee or community member. Going on to say, the mayor clearly stated during the September 12th council meeting that he will continue to try to remove me from the commission, even if it means doing a charter change that would prohibit anyone not living in the city to serve on a committee, a commission, or a board. Mounier will continue in her role as the city's planning commissioner. She says she's focused on creating more housing in the community to help both the homeless and those majorly affected by the flood. In Barry Tyler Bronski, NBC5 News.